You're watching Pitch It With The Pates and join us as we have a look at the Heimer Group showcase at Loudham Leisure World in Nottingham. We're really excited to be having a look at the Heimer Venture S. It's a futuristic motorhome which is really groundbreaking in terms of the engineering and some of the features that are included on that particular model. So we're really fortunate today to be able to have some time alone with that particular vehicle. So join us as we take a look. Okay, so stepping inside the Venture S, we're very fortunate to have this plugged in so we can actually see what the ambient lighting looks like. So this is one of the original prototypes from 2019 and it was a, a collaboration between Heimer, Mercedes and BASF. So this is based on a Mercedes Sprinter. So this is very familiar if you're used to driving Mercedes products. You've got MBUX at the front for media and the control. This is a left-hand drive with it being the original or one of the original prototypes. It's got the automatic gearbox. It's just under six and a half meters long and 2.16 meters wide. So it's a very compact motorhome and it is redefining the definition of a motorhome. It's all wheel drive and um, it's 190 brake horse. So plenty of power and this particular model, when we have a look outside, we'll see it's got the 18 inch optional alloy wheels with these studded off-road tires. But it's a really, really luxurious place to be. So it retails at around 200,000 pounds. So 200,000 British pounds. However, by the time you add a few optional extras onto this, so currently this model that we're looking at now with this spec is in the region of 230,000 pounds. So some of the materials that are used, so if we look into the kitchen area, you can see the quality of the materials. So you've got bamboo scattered throughout the interior. Really lifts the area. You've got that infinity window at the back and they're privacy tinted also. On the cupboard doors, you've got real leather tabs we'll have a look at the opening of those in a moment the matte black tap in the kitchen area it looks really really high quality it's got a real boutique hotel feel to it okay so let's have a look at some of the storage in this Heimer Venture S. So we've got really big drawers built into this staircase. So these are bamboo steps that go up onto the upper deck, which we'll look at a little later. But they are functional, not only in the fact that they are steps to the upper deck, 
but they are also cupboards with lots and lots of storage nice and deep storage area within so you've got a 115 litre under counter fridge freezer so lots of space in this two berth motorhome to store your things there got the cutlery drawer built in on an inner drawer there so again lots of room for organizing your things or soft clothes as you'd expect even the pads on the the back there are unusual rather than the normal clear gel tabs so yeah lots and lots of space to store your things stainless steel sink got some power sockets there 230 volt just in the top corner of the kitchen and you've got a two gas burner hob so to the rear we've got your lounging area with a fold out table which comes out into the center from underneath that rear bench and that goes out onto the sun deck which has a maximum weight limit of 350 kilograms so plenty for a couple to sit out on there yeah really nice to stand on the edge of this sun deck really unique and when the door is shut you've got the infinity window which goes all the way around to give you a great view on site where you're parked we've also got the customizable modular lighting so you can move the lighting around to suit so this for example can be clipped on to the top there and it can light your dining table when that's in position and similar here you've got lighting that can move around throughout the motorhome you've got the washroom area so this is set into the standard position the window to the side there a continuation of the matte black features with the towel hooks tap but that would be the standard position that we'd have the washroom in during most circumstances however it has a little trick feature where this actually slides right the way out on the rail as you can see and then if we just pop into this space here we can then unclip this wall which reveals and opens up your shower space so this is then your shower cubicle again bamboo finished on that side rear panel a duck board there on the floor but that has now transformed that space into the shower area and then again that just pops back opposite way brings the sink back clips back into position and then the whole 
of that area pushes back and goes back into the standard washer and configuration. So really, really innovative. I feel very fortunate to be able to get into this Venture S today. Tried to have a look at this particular model at the October show in 2022, but really struggled because of the queues to actually get any access in. So to have this to myself for half an hour or so, feel very fortunate. So we'll just have a look at how this rear dining table pulls out into dining mode and then pops back under that bench. It's a really innovative design and it's got that bamboo tabletop finish. This motorhome has a seven inch touch control display. And this controls all the elements for the motorhome itself. So you've got your wastewater, fresh water tank information, the vehicle battery information. Um, this particular model has three solar panels so 315 watt solar panels and it's got that control information on there also you can also control the control panel through the Hymer Connect app which is similar to the system that Swift use on the Swift command so I'm a real big fan of any technology such as this but well, this does look really really slick Okay, so let's go up to the upper deck. So moving to the upper deck. So this is a double insulated pop top. So it's unlike any other pop top that I've seen before. It's got this very unique material so this is air filled through a compressor and it inflates or fully inflates in less than three minutes. The mattress is also part of that inflation and you can control the firmness of the mattress through the uh, Hymer app. So you've got more of that bamboo finish. You've got controls for the lighting. USB, 12 volt. These are the um, inlets for the air. Got a skylight. Blind and fly nets. But wow, this is really, really special. And this material is so unique. You've got that huge viewing area to look out onto the site where you're staying. And I'm just sat on this mattress now and it's extremely comfortable. But again, can be tailored to the individual through the app, which is amazing. Okay, let's go back down into the main living area. So color options currently available are the source blue and the pebble gray. So my particular favorite is the source blue. And with the collaboration with BASF, the um, 
paint used is actually a special paint which is more resilient to stone chips and some of the external plastics are also coated and they are more resistant to stone chips etc so makes it a much more rugged vehicle it is double floored also so there is storage underneath these flaps and these particular motorhomes have diesel heating there is a provision for one gas bottle which we'll have a look when we pop outside so this is the source blue with the 18 inch alloy wheels it's got the chip resistant paint finish and the mouldings are all chip resistant also tinted windows it's got the two lay pull out sun canopy it's got the off-road studded tires look great on these 18 inch optional extras It's got the LED light bar up on the front. We've got the three solar panels on top, 115 watts each. We've got that double walled insulated pop top. External shower point. And everything's hidden. So you've got the storage area to the rear side for your gas bottle and your diesel for your heating. So everything is tucked out of the way, nothing's on display to ruin the aesthetic of this amazing looking vehicle. really well integrated there into the side of the motorhome. Okay, so that concludes our overview of the Heimer Venture S. Feel really, really lucky to have a look at these today and have access to them for as long as I have. Let us know what you think in the comments below. Please like and subscribe and we'll see you in the next one. Thanks for watching.